Hi, my name is Larry Flick, and I'm your professor for Principles of Management Online for the spring of 2013. I wanted to do this video to show you particularly how to get into My Management Lab and look at and do the exercises that are assigned each week. Starting out from our Blackboard Learn class site, if you would go down the menu on the left and click on My Management Lab link, and then sign in using your user ID and password and check into the Principles of Management Online Spring 2013 class. And once you do those things, you'll see this screen. Okay, now to start off with, I want to talk about the menu. Okay, starting with uh, Course Home. This is what you'll see at Course Home. That's where you'll come each time. The assignment calendar is very important, and that's where you'll find what is assigned and when. Now, for performance reporting and others down the line, you'll see it next to it a uh, monitor with a line through it. Those things you're not going to see. Unfortunately, all I can do is show you the instructor's view, uh, but when you go in, you're not going to see performance reporting, submissions, communication tools, and so forth. Okay, so you are going to see Course Home, Assignment Calendar, Gradebook, uh, eText if you purchased it, uh, Course Content, Course Resources, and Student Support. Okay, so what I wanted to do is start off by going into Course Content. When you click on that link, you'll see all the chapters lined up 1 through 15. So if you click on the first chapter and any other as you go through, you'll see this page for the first chapter. Each chapter has an interactive lecture, which I'd like you to uh, view after reading the chapter. I'm going to click on it here and launch it. Uh, chapter one. And I'll be quiet for a second. Management. Although most managers don't deal with employees who could indeed be saving the world, tell who managers are and where they work. Manic organizations, organization managers. Although manic titles, identifying exactly who the manic. Now there's just an example. You can also navigate uh, through by uh, looking at the menu on the left for the interactive lectures, and and you can uh, go to objective four and explain why it's important. You to can study management. You can also start and stop and, and go backwards and forwards and uh, that kind of thing. Explain why so, it's important. Okay, to I'm, I'm going to click on the tabs at left. Stop that for now. Okay. Now, uh, that would appear when you click the chapter one and you'd see right at the header. Okay. Uh, this area right here. Now, Let's look at the assignments, okay? Before we do, uh, let me go back. Look under Chapter 1 and look at the six sections, okay? The first section is Recall, Study Plan, uh, Study Plan, uh, Apply. So the first one's Recall, then Apply. And then the video uh, here, the Apply Video Exercise uh, and the Apply Simulation Exercises are right here. The first chapter you're assigned to do, and I'll show you how you'll know, you're assigned to do the Apply Video chapter. The second chapter, if we open up, you'll be assigned to do the Apply Simulation chapter. Then the third chapter will go back to Video, the fourth chapter will go back to Simulation, and so forth. So let's go up to um, the first chapter and click on the Video Exercise. Okay. Now, you're not going to be seeing the same thing, but you will get to this page where there is the questions. I think there's five or six. And the video, uh, you'll click here. And I'm going to drag it over so you can, you can see it. And you'll be able to see the video in one window and, and your test in another. And uh, I'll turn this on for a moment. Now you can stop it, you can move the uh, uh, bar to different sections of the video. Uh, so basically I would recommend that basic, basically I'd recommend that you read 
the uh, quiz questions first and then you look at the video and you can do them simultaneously clicking back and forth uh, regardless I think it's uh, fairly straightforward and should be fairly easy but I think there's a good learning experience in doing this that's why you're assigned uh, these so let's let's go back and uh, just know that the recall study plan the apply study plan are for your practice only and there will be no grading uh, concerned okay for our class also the apply simulation exercise well that's every other chapter and uh, the analyze critical thinking and the mastery test are for your self-study only the only two uh, assignments for each chapter the first will be the video the second will be the um, will be the simulation the third will be the video and so forth they'll alternate throughout you're only assigned one item per chapter okay now how do you know what you're assigned let's go back and and go to the menu and click on assignment calendar okay it takes a moment to come up but uh, I, I want you to just go back I want I, and I want you to know that there's only one assignment per chapter and it either is going to be a video exercise or a simulation and if there's a choice of simulations it'll always be the simulation number one okay now the assignment calendar is open let's look at it uh, you can look at it with uh, list view a month view and a term view let's look at the term now today is uh, the 27th the day I'm doing this video but uh, if we scroll down we've got February February 3rd 10th 17th 24th so we can see there's assignments uh, on, that are due on Sunday of each week except here is spring break okay now if we if we go back and look at it on a monthly basis we know nothing's due here in January but February when you roll over this you'll see that uh, chapter one apply video exercise so it may be live in your version it's not that link there is not alive here so I would go over here to chapter one video exercise and click that and then you, you would simply go into it uh, you would click uh, here uh, you would see the video there and I won't play it because we did before and you would answer the questions and in the end you would save and submit them save the answers uh, and then save and submit them and they the answers and your grades will go into a grade book okay um, the same thing again with the uh, simulation exercises here's an example where there's a one and a two uh, you would always choose one but how do you know you can go back to the assignment calendar here again it takes a moment to load but uh, uh, when it does we'll look at chapter two and um, you can also look at the gradebook anytime while this thing's loading okay let, let's go to the month and let's look at chapter two and you'll see it says simulation exercise one so that's how you'll know what's assigned now you can do these assignments anytime during the week and if you miss doing one I'm not going to shut it off you will be able to do it after the uh, due date so don't worry about uh, fixed due dates okay that's enough if you have any questions at all uh, please contact me I'd like you to always use the blackboard learn class site and the message system there uh, but you can call me as well so we'll stop for now thank you